And welcome to So Cool Science! Science you can do right at home! I'm just trying to open up this laptop using mental powers! Um, but it's not working. And I'm going over today's science file. And today's science file says... If telekinetic powers are not real, how do you explain the moving objects? Well, try this. Ow! You will need to practice your good acting. Oh, wait. It's on the other side of the room. No problem. I just used my telekinetic powers. What? You're going to be like the car's moving, Chris, but there's no one behind the wheel. Someone farted. There's only two of us in the room. Who's done? Wow! I, you just want proof! Yeah, you, you just want some evidence that I'm not some sort of loony bat! Well, take a look at this. Okay, we're gonna use this lamp right here, and I'll show you that I have telekinetic powers. Don't take your eyes off the lamp! Ha <laughs> ha! That is so cool! Now, for people who think there's something on the bottom, there's nothing on the bottom, nothing on the desk, and, for those of you who think there's a string attached to the lamp, I'm going to hand the lamp off screen to someone so they can take it away. There you have it. The lamp moved all by itself. There was nothing on the bottom end of the lamp. The lamp had no strings attached to it whatsoever. And the camera never ever cut away. But more importantly, the cameraman never ever <laughs> cut the cheese. <laughs> So, is that enough evidence for you to think that I have telekinetic powers? Well, take a closer look at this. Telekinesis is a claim that someone has psychic powers that are able to move or change the shape of an object without the use of any physical forces. You can see just how easy it is to look like you have telekinetic powers. Get a washer and tie on a piece of thread. Attach the thread to your shirt, then place the object on top of the washer. Now slowly move your body backwards and the object will look as though it moves on its own. Although seeing an object move on its own with your eyes may seem like scientific evidence, in science seeing isn't always believing. When we want to test these people in a scientific lab, they either refuse to be tested or are unable to repeat their evidence. Since they are unable to repeat the evidence they gave, moving objects with your mind is not scientific evidence. So now you know that no one has telekinetic powers. You know, making it look like you have telekinetic powers is why science is so cool.